Legend has it that in ancient China, there was a type of armor made entirely from paper, and it was said to be as tough as steel. But could that really be true? To find out, the team set out to make a set of paper armor and put it to the test. Historical records describe it as being made from mulberry bark paper, about half an inch thick, built from roughly 28 layers stacked together. The sheets were cut into squares, then either glued with resin and pressed flat, or wrapped in cotton cloth and sewn along the edges. They first tested small samples from both methods. The resin turned the paper brittle, hurting its performance, while the cotton-wrapped method gave far better protection. Next came a direct showdown, paper armor versus steel armor. To keep it fair, the paper was stacked to match the steel's thickness. A mechanical arm, set to human strength and swing speed, delivered the blows. Blunt force test. Steel armor barely dented the clay dummy underneath, while paper armor left a much deeper impression. Against blunt weapons, paper clearly fell short. Sharp weapon test. With no armor, the blade bit one inch deep into the clay. With armor, both steel and paper stopped the cut effectively. Arrow test. Steel armor let the arrow sink about a quarter inch. Paper armor, only about an eighth of an inch. An impressive win for paper. They then built a full paper suit while borrowing a steel set from a military supplier. Mannequins were dressed in each and attacked with a variety of ancient Chinese weapons. Archery. Three archers fired from 20 feet. Neither suit let an arrow through, but a light rain revealed paper's biggest weakness. Water. Broadsword. Both chopping and thrusting strikes were stopped equally well by paper and steel. Firearms. Against a handgun, neither armor stood a chance. Their verdict? Paper armor can absolutely work in real combat, offering protection similar to steel, but its durability is nowhere near as good. Rumor confirmed. 